Hey everyone, TechnoMentor here with a video for you guys. Now, if you're getting this issue where your account cannot be created at this time, whenever you're trying to create a new Apple ID, you want to follow these steps to fix this. The very first thing is you want to go ahead and try it from a browser. So try going to Safari or on a computer and you're going to go to account.apple.com. Once you go to account.apple.com, this website lets you create an Apple ID account. So what you do is click on the top here, create your Apple I account. And then once you create it here by filling in all this information, your phone number and everything, you'll create it. And then you go ahead and sign into your device, which is going to be a quick and easy fix. Now you may, if this method isn't working for you for some reason, the other thing you can also do is try a different device, like another iPhone, iPad, or MacBook. And once you create it there, sign out of there and then sign into the device that you want to use. That Apple ID is going to be unique to you so what you can use it on any device so you can do that as well now another thing you want to do is depending on the Wi-Fi that you're in if you try a different Wi-Fi sometimes Apple might block IP or Wi-Fi network that looks suspicious so try a different one or switch to mobile data so instead of using Wi-Fi to create it take your Wi-Fi off and use your mobile data that's going to be another option as well for you now, another thing you're going to want to do is is that make sure that you're not using any VPN. So in your settings, go to general, and then you're gonna go to device management. You're gonna turn off any BPM to do this. Sometimes BPN are blocked from creating accounts, so you don't want to use a BPN. Now, along with that, other thing you wanna consider doing is in your settings, go to general, and then check that the date and the time matches up here to your zone. Now, if it doesn't, you can turn this off, set it manually, but make sure that time is correct to wherever you are. Ideally, you want it to set automatically, but in there are scenarios you may have to set it manually. Now, let's say you're trying all this and you just want to create the account. Try a different Apple, different account, email account. So whenever you're looking to create it, instead of using the one that you're trying to do it with, try a different email because the one that you might be using might not be working well. Usually Gmail works really good when it comes to Apple ID, but any email should work, but do try a different one. And if you've done all of this and you're still having an issue and you wanna create on your device, the next thing you wanna do is go ahead and make sure you update your phone. So in your settings, go to general, and then software update. Make sure your phone is up to date. Sometimes older version doesn't allow you to create Apple ID account, and it's always good to update it to make sure you're on the latest version. And then if you're still having issues, the next thing you wanna go ahead and do is make sure that Apple service isn't down. Sometimes it is down. So what do you do is go to Apple system status page. This page basically, if you search it up, shows all the status. Basically you want Apple account to be available. There are scenarios where it's unavailable and Apple usually fixes it because their servers are under maintenance or having problems. You want to wait it. Sometimes you may have to wait up to 24 hours and then retry again. But you should be able to create your account by following these steps. And I hope this video was helpful. So please consider the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone. We'll see you guys next time.